Hi everyone, my name is Gerard Legaspi. I'm a second year student at the University of California, Berkeley, and I built a website with smartsocial.com. Gerard, you built a website a couple years ago when you were in high school, you went through our program. The website looks awesome. We're gonna show it to everybody who's viewing right now. Gerard, have you Googled yourself lately? I haven't. <laughs> okay, let's Google yourself and show you the benefit. Your first thing that comes up is your personal webpage. So when people search for you, they don't get all these other people who've been arrested or anything else, right? Who are not you, but instead they get your contact page, your passion, your projects, your public service, and it takes them right to your website so they can learn and find the Gerard that they're looking for. Gerard, what was it like? Was it difficult building a website? What was that experience like? It wasn't difficult at all. It was super easy just compiling like a list of your past experiences, specifying what your passions are. And even if you don't know what your passion is yet, building the website definitely helps you get there. And it's super, super helpful, especially now that we're living like a digital world. And it's super easy for future employers and even colleges to just simply search your name up and find a website that's catered to you. And it's super, super easy, especially doing it through smartsocial.com. How has your personal website helped you to apply to either college or an internship or career or on-campus clubs? Where do you put the link? What do you do with it? And, and how do you think it's helped you? Yeah. So I remember in high school, I developed the website when I was applying to colleges and stuff like that. And although there isn't like a section in college apps where it says your own personal website, developing the website allowed me to put this link in my resume whenever I was applying to internship and any like roles on campus. Specifically for me, it really allowed me to become like the RA in the residence halls that I am now. It also let me be a lab assistant working in the lab on campus. And overall, it just really put me a step forward above everyone else. Because not everyone has a personal website, but having that allows employers to really know who you are as a person, rather than like a simple resume that is traditionally given to employers. Yeah. So do you feel like this is giving you the upper edge to help you stand out? 100%. Yeah, I really do think it does. Now we're living in like a digital world and paper is kind of out of the game, like especially with like remote learning and everything's virtual through Zoom. Instead of like a traditional cover letter, this website allows you to really put all of your interests in one place. And it's super easy for employers to like just search up your name and then you see like this list of items that this person has done, things they're interested in, stuff like that. A lot of people are intimidated. If I have a website, I have to update it every day. And we like to remind them you don't. It's only when you have something big and new to share. Gerard, how often do you update your website? I updated mine about six months ago when I like first came to Berkeley and I kind of got acclimated and everything and started getting these like new roles on campus. You're doing so great. You're so positive on Instagram. You've taken all that branding that we worked on with your website and applied it to Instagram and gotten everything you're working so hard for. For the rest of you who are watching this, you can learn more at smartsocial.com, where students like Gerard in middle school and in high school build a private portfolio first, and then we launch it just like Gerard so that their Google results shine online. And it's the first thing that comes up so that not only do they shine online, but they're making better decisions, planning their purpose, their passion, their projects like Gerard did. And then they're also impressing that future college future internship and future career. Gerard, you're going places. Really proud of you. Thanks so much. We'll see everybody very soon. Have a great day. Thanks, Josh.